The Honourable Member representing Taka Sumaila Federal Constituency of Kano State, Honourable Shamsuddin Bello Dambuzwa, has urged the federal government to make security chiefs in their various commands face the consequences of their failure whenever they are found culpable. The federal lawmaker made the call during a briefing with members of the House of Representatives Press Corps while preferring solutions to the numerous cases of attacks across the country, with the recent being the kidnap of passengers waiting to board the Takwe Wari bound train last week Saturday. Recall that the Independent National Electoral Commission recently raised concerns that the 2023 general elections may be postponed or cancelled due to persistent wave of insecurity in the country. We need to have more geospatial mapping of Nigeria, which will bring in the, the talk of artificial intelligence. That is where it will come into play, where we can map out the country, where we know if there is an attack at a specific place, where we know we can scramble these jets or send these unmanned drones to attack these terrorists and also to secure the Nigerian airspace. So um, I think so far so good. This government has done very well. There's room for improvement. More can be done. I think people should be held accountable. There should be set targets. Because if you don't have a performance target, then there's no way you can review to see how good you've been doing. You'll just be freestyling and doing anyhow. But if I tell you, like, look, today I don't want to hear of any attack in such and such place by the next two weeks. I've given you a target. You don't meet that target, then there will be consequences. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.